We follow him to his next stop and find a crowd so big that Border Patrol needs buses. For years, migrants who crossed illegally would run from law enforcement, terrified to be caught. Here we watch them run to them, eager to be processed, knowing they'll be released in a few days to await court dates that could be years away. It all seems so orderly. They're given a tag for their carry-on, line up to show their documents, which are then scanned using an app. The men handcuffed to each other before boarding. After what can be several days in CBP custody, the migrants are then bused north into San Diego. Each day, several hundred are released at this makeshift logistics hub funded by San Diego County. It's here nonprofits help coordinate travel to other cities. As I find out, communication is another. Spanish and English, no longer enough. Kazakhstan, yeah, Uzbekistan, Turkey. 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 Wow. Uzbekistan. Uzbekistan. Chinese. China. China. The Border Patrol agents, I know that they didn't sign up to be Uber because that's the, all they are right now is Uber. I understand, hey, this country was built on immigration. I'm fine with that, but not like this. This is ridiculous. Silva suggests we stay through the night and see for ourselves. So we do. We capture this from a camera we set up in another part of Silva's property. Look at this massive group crossing and see the headlights on the Mexican side? Likely a smuggler who dropped them off. The senior CBP official tells me that Border Patrol does not have the authority to stand on the border, Anderson, and push people back to prevent them from entering the country. They have to let them come in. They then take them into custody. They inspect them and they process them. And what was fascinating to me and my team is nearly every single migrant we came across seemed to know the deal. Somebody who had gone ahead of them, either a loved one or a friend, relate it so they knew what to expect and they were looking forward to getting closer to those CBP agents just to start the process, Anderson.